Ooh, welcome back to the Wise Work Studio. We're very glad you're here. Today, we got myself and Wyatt here. Yeah. Um, today, around noon, the new trailer for Dune came out, the final one, before the film comes out on the 22nd mm -hmm. of this month. You're looking forward to I'm it. I'm really looking forward to it. <laughs> I'm really excited for yeah. the movie. I am too, man. I don't really, honestly, I don't know a whole lot about the storyline. Mm -hmm. Um but I'm really looking forward to learning. I'm excited to see what this film has for us. And even just for me, the story of Dune itself, because I haven't experienced it at ever. So you're wanting to go into this movie fresh. I am. I am coming into it fresh. Okay. You didn't watch Dune with me? No, movie? I haven't. The yeah. old one? No, I haven't. Who did I watch that with? I, don't know. I watched it with John, Mark, and Ethan over the phone. <laughs> that's what That's what it was. Well, we, uh, we're, me and Wyatt are going to be watching the trailer for the, well, the final trailer for Dune, um, and we're going to react to it and then give our thoughts afterward. So, um, yeah, let's get into it. Oh, that's cool. Mm -hmm. yeah. They're like fireflies. Oh, there she is. Mm -hmm. <laughs> oh, that's Skarsgård. Mm -hmm. <laughs> oh, cool. Wait, hold on. Okay, yeah. Maybe. It's not safe for you here. I must not fear. Fear is the mind killer. No. Mm. Very nice. Very nice. Yeah. We had a lot of information in that. Yeah, absolutely. Okay, so this, right off the bat, it said it's going to be the next Lord of the Rings, the next Star Wars. Do you agree with that? It should be. Okay. Um, it's, it's one of those stories that has been around longer than those other ones written mm -hmm. um maybe not lord of the rings i'm not sure the exact dates but yeah this has been around for quite some time it inspired a lot of star wars it inspired a lot of what we think of in modern sci-fi yeah today and i i really would hope that it's the next big thing yeah but I, I know that there's, like, the whole controversy around it, and it's coming out of HBO and in theaters. Mm. Um, we're going to go watch it in theaters, for sure. Um, but I, I guess it's just kind of, I'm looking at it, and I don't know the story, and so I don't really know what to think of it yet. So, and So real quick, yes. on this video, I'm going to give you a brief, Good. the briefest rundown of the story. Good, okay. Um, there's an emperor. All right. He's trying to control what's called the spice on Dune. Okay. Um, and he is using the house Harkonnen to secure 
the spice for him without without looking what's the house harkonnen they're the bad guys okay the house atreides um they're the ones he the so so they sort of make it look like house atreides is in charge of dune gotcha as a trap okay to get rid of house atreides okay um things happen he ends up in the desert and he has to fight against house harkonnen using um his abilities Mm -hmm. he has the abilities of his mother who is essentially like um she's kind of like a jedi okay (laughs) okay but but in that's terms in which it's easy to understand yes she has powers you know uh uh being able to command people Mm -hmm. with her speech and and a, a special way of fighting yeah um but he also has the abilities of what are called mentats okay. which are human supercomputers. Okay. Gotcha. So he is they she she thinks he could be um sort of like this this uh, it would sort of be like your chosen one kind okay. of Okay. Yes. Thing, I got but you. it's it's more than that. It's more the culmination of years of selective breeding. Yes. on on the part of her sect. Of okay. Jedi women. <laughs> Jedi. Um, and he's supposed to do something great. Okay, gotcha. So that's sort of the story. And as far as location, they're on a planet. Mm-hmm. Is Dune the desert planet? So Dune, Arrakis is the desert planet. Okay. He His family comes from a very lush, water-rich, mm-hmm. green planet that they show. Um, and then they... But Dune is the spice... The spice is important because it allows um, – not only is it extremely expensive, yes, but it also um, is important for, like, interstellar space travel. Mm-hmm. So that everybody wants it. It's a hot commodity. Gotcha. Gotcha. Well, I mean, like I said, I'm, I'm going to be experiencing mm. this story yeah. fresh because I haven't seen it. I haven't seen the old ones. I haven't – read the books these are books right yes yes i have not read the books i don't know much about this story the trailers both the first one and now this one are very intriguing um the visuals are crazy cool they look amazing the, they look so, awesome. so those um those those plane helicopter dragonfly looking things mm-hmm. those uh in the book in the book, it sort of describes the wings as moving. Yes. And so we always imagine them like dragonflies. Okay. And the fact that they're dragonflies. Yeah. <laughs> in in this. Yes. Is so cool. They look amazing. And so this was this was th- this is that a new concept? Those dragonfly looking ships. Uh, in like in the book, you're not super clear on what the ships look like. Just okay, that they, they have wings, and the wings move. Okay. So I always assume that they moved fast enough to be like uh, almost like a helicopter or a yeah. dragonfly. Well, that's cool. I mean, they look, they are designed like dragonflies. Um, the characters obviously are look awesome. Yeah. Skarsgård, I guess he's the villain. Yeah. He looks sick. I don't know what that stuff was that he was coming out I of. I don't know either. But <laughs> His character is so big yeah so fat that he uses like these gravity belts to he he almost floats he's very bouncy oh really and so it gives it it's, he's got an almost unnerving kind of movement because, oh uh um duncan idaho mm-hmm. character which is uh momoa jason okay. momoa jason yeah we got a lot of him in that trailer we did quite a bit is he is he a relative to the lead he he is uh he's like he's kind of like a, a a captain of the guard okay he's, so he's just a friend he's yeah he's close he's close friend. friends with um paul's father okay and i'm 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 sort of i'm sort of confused i don't know if i haven't if they haven't shown them off in the trailer but they've shown duncan mm-hmm. they've shown uh gurney halleck Okay. But they haven't shown uh, Thufia Howitt yet. Gotcha. Who is their mentat, their human supercomputer. Okay. Who does all their strategizing and everything. Well. If if they have been in the trailer, maybe it's just slipping my mind, but. Yeah. They, they're supposed to have really red lips. 
Oh, really? So you're supposed to be able to recognize them. <laughs> okay. Okay. Well, the lineup's awesome. Mm-hmm. I don't know. I mean, I obviously know Jason Momoa. I know Zendaya. Um, they're, I love their acting. Mm-hmm. So I'm excited to see this. Yeah. Um, I did want to tell you, though. Mm. I'm going to be on vacation when this comes out. Oh, no. So we're going to, me and Kenzie are already actually planning on going to a vintage mm-hmm. theater in, uh, on the other side of Virginia, and we're going to watch it there. Okay. So you guys are going to have to watch it here mm-hmm. so we can come back together and debrief. Yeah. <laughs> and we might even do a watch party for this movie. We might even do a watch party. Mm-hmm. If we do, you will see it. Yeah. Um, but anyways, uh, I think that's about our thoughts. Obviously, um, oh, I did want to bring up one more thing. They kind of gave probably a kind of important moment mm-hmm. in the film away. Jason Momoa's character, when they do the – the sword to the head, like mm-hmm. a respect thing. Um, he hits it. He closes the door as he's doing it, and yeah. he's like, "No." So is he like? Seems like they're giving away a, a are, important. Are plot you point. asking if Duncan Idaho dies? I am. I can't tell you that. Oh no! I can't tell. I can't tell you what happens. I'm not going to tell you what happens all to right. any of the characters. Okay. Well, um, th- that's all the thoughts I have. Thank you for giving me that yeah, debrief. Yeah, of course. Um, I'm real excited. October twenty second. If yeah. you if you guys weren't aware or you just haven't been keeping up with it, October twenty second. Get your tickets to watch it in the theater because they need to make money so they can keep making. Oh yes, yeah. and, um, and and it, there's this. I think this movie is gonna look great on the mm-hmm. big screen. I think you're really gonna be able to appreciate it. So what? Yes. So watch it on the big screen and then rewatch it on HBO Max after you've given them mm-hmm. a ticket. A ticket. You know? yeah, yeah. Yeah. I'm. I'm not usually one for you know paying the man. But when it but comes, but I to... want. I want more of this. <laughs> paying the man. Uh, <laughs> yeah. No. Go. Go buy a ticket for yeah. this because you. We want to see. This isn't. This isn't going to be the whole story. This mm-hmm. is only going to be like the first half. Yeah. Of of the first book. So yes. We want to see more. Oh, yeah. Um. Real quick, let's acknowledge. We got a couple. Uh. Well, we got one person that says they love our content. Oh, that is so nice. Thank you so much. Thank you very much. We we love we you. we really appreciate that. Absolutely. We really do. Because we slave away at this content. Oh, and we're man. like, man, we're working so hard. I hope hard. somebody's entertained. I just got home from work. Honestly, and <laughs> I got home from work and set up a live. So yeah, I mean, just set up cameras, everything. Mm-hmm. Um, we so do it for you. Yeah, we really appreciate you guys coming here and watching. Absolutely. Um, but we'll go ahead and end this. We'll uh, leave it on. If you guys want to leave a comment, we'll stay on for just a few minutes where I can interact with you in the comment section on the live chat. Um, but if you're not already, subscribe to the channel. Mm-hmm. Um, we would really appreciate it if you kept up with us, if you're not already subscribed. And then also... Um, we have a podcast that comes out every Monday morning at 7 a.m. It's on a channel called WiseWorks Podcast. So WiseWorks Studio, WiseWorks Podcast. WiseWorks Podcast is where we keep more of our long-form content mm-hmm. and we keep our shorter-form commentary content on WiseWorks Studio. Yeah. So uh, And, and if you're, if you're watching right now, uh, we're, we're sort of at the end of our video. We're mm-hmm. going to stick around for a minute or two to talk if you guys want to talk. Uh, but this video will be going up on the studio channel as a regular video. Absolutely. So if you didn't get to see the whole thing, you'll get to see it. Don't worry. Yeah. So uh, we love you. Thank you. Uh, stick around. We'll talk yeah. to you in the chat for a few minutes.